I'm Malcolm McNeil from Australian Longline. I'm on board our new vessel, the Antarctic Aurora. This is a $40 million investment in a longline fishing vessel designed to go and catch Patagonian toothfish and Antarctic toothfish in the subantarctic and the Antarctic waters. Such an investment is borne by two requirements. One, to replace an older vessel, but more importantly is our confidence and the sustainability of the fish docks that we operate in. The science underpinning the Heard Island fisheries and the Antarctic water fisheries provide us with a long-term view of catching fish sustainably for the next, up to the next 40 years. We're confident that the fisheries are sustainable and have been sustainable for a long time and will be into the future. This sustainability, apart from the good science that underpinned the stock assessment, it also relates to the fact that pirate fishing or the IEU fishing over the last 20, 30 years has now diminished to low levels, if any at all. The removal of such pirate fishing has enabled us to ensure that our fish stocks are there for us to catch, for the legal vessels to catch, as opposed to pirate fishing. So the reasons why we looked at investing in, into a brand new boat was to take into account safety at sea, is to take into account the environmental aspects, seabirds, ensuring that we don't catch any seabirds, and we're leaving a smaller footprint, environmental footprint, as we can in the areas that we're fishing in. Some of the technologies that we've put into this, into this vessel include such things as underwater setting. We can now have the lines clearing the stern of the vessel with the lines already one to two metres under the water, therefore reducing any ability for the seabirds to see the baited hooks. We have also got a moon pool on this vessel, and a moon pool is a hole in the centre of the vessel from which we can haul our lines through. It prevents any seabirds being attracted to the lines being hauled at the same time. One of the other technologies that we have on this boat is a diesel electric propulsion system. This system ensures that we're using less power or only making enough power that is required to operate the vessel, therefore using less fuel and therefore reducing our carbon footprint. So the Patagonian Antarctic tooth fisheries that we operate in are well managed and there's this kind of sustainability and confidence that enables us to go and purchase such a new vessel.